Hey all you cool cats and welcome back to another episode of Rampa Ultra Despair Girls. And we got our hacking gun back and we just saw Nagito and we basically downgraded our gun to... Hmm. Oh, I guess I only have break. Yeah, I only have break. I got a limited number of shots too. Unless, unless it reloads? No. I think that's a limited number. New truth bullet. Move. Time for another tutorial. Looks like you have obtained move. Move is a truth bullet that can activate some machines with super-powered hacking magic. Try it on that power panel with the red light. Oh, and I know you probably remember, but you can press the square button to change ammo. Um, I was just thinking to myself, I'm maybe I don't have to voice any of the characters this time around. It's unlocked. But I'm scared. Because it seems like everyone's been voiced so far. Time for another tutorial. Now that you've put in some time with the hacking gun, let me tell you something. The, the red left eye is a weak point for all Monokumas. Shoot the weak point with break and most Monokumas go down in one shot. Plus, after you hit a weak spot, break ammo will give you one power shot. It's one hell of a shot and that's one way to get stronger than a regular break. Now that that's killing two birds with one stone. If you think you're so hot, why not try aiming for the weak point? My aiming skill has been bad so far, though. There it is again! Oh, there. The gun. It's weaker. Oh. Is this the game balance that guy was talking about? There's a monokuma down that way. Not that way. Back. Is this the right way? No, it's a dead end. But how do I know that there's not going to be something? Well, you know what? That coin might vanish. I shouldn't mess around. Hmm. Looks like this isn't the right way. <laughs> Did I just get oh, locked geez. in? to move something again maybe oh my god okay this camera is fighting me okay 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 <laughs> okay that that's that's a bit better I think go up to the room past the stairs oh it doesn't look like it's the only option it's it's weird because auto moves faster than than rotating it. Maybe wait, there might be a Is there a way to like quickly turn? See, look, when that moves so much faster. And this is so much slower. I I, I think I need to keep it on auto because I can't turn fast enough. If, if only I could move faster. All right, what's on the other side of this door? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> it's got the you, you're those kids. School chime. The kids who were on TV. Oh man, I'm famous. <laughs> I'd autograph your back anytime. <laughs> I can only write using a chisel, but if you don't mind that, I can sign your back, too. Your we accept you? presents as well. I'm always in the mood for sweets. However, salty flavors are no good. Those disgusting tastes are never worth putting in your mouth. Mm, I want to drive a train someday, but can't. I want to go inside a chimney. Something's not right about that one. <laughs> one with the, the chisel in his hand. Okay, and you're the leader. Welcome, Big Sis. 
I'm so happy you came, Meow. Did you just meow at me? <laughs> um... Uh... Oh, that's right. Big Sis doesn't know us yet. Well, I guess we should start with introductions. All right, let's start with me, the leader. Oh, square button. I'm the super duper leader that unites the warriors of hope with a bang, Masaru Diamond. Okay, you're the leader. My special subject was PE, so they called me Lil Ultimate PE. I'm the PE king who can do every exercise ever. Running nonstop 24-7, 365 is easy as pie. Oh, I almost forgot. My job in the Warriors of Hope is the hero. And as hero and the leader, I'm gonna be the new ruler of this town. I'm the leader of the Warriors of Hope. Hero class, Masaru Diamond. Oh, maybe, maybe watching that square thing is optional. I always give 100%. My favorite class was gym, so they called me Lil Ultimate PE. Aha! A hero, the leader, and the Lil Ultimate PE. I even impressed myself. Huh. You're far too boastful to be a leader. A true leader is calm and dignified. Like yourself, I assume. But I am the leader. We all agreed on it. All he did was win rock, paper, scissors. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm still the leader. I won, so I'm the leader. The okay. leader! You're probably just the hot-blooded one. Fine, fine. You're the leader. Now, allow me to introduce myself. I am the sage, Nagisa Shingetsu. I am the vice leader of sorts. All right. My name is Nagisa Shingetsu. In the Warriors of Hope, I act as the vice leader and sage. When I attended elementary school, I was known as Little Ultimate Social Studies. What a lame ultimate power. Of course, social studies is but one area of my expertise. I excel at all scholarly pursuits. I was labeled little ultimate social studies because I was raised to be among society's elite. Oh, so you're like a mini Tagami or something. <laughs> and I suppose I am a babysitter of sorts for the Warriors of Hope. Monica excluded. Monica is the one in the wheelchair? During my time at Hope's Peak Elementary, I was known as Little Ultimate Social Studies. Huh? Hope's Peak? You mean... that Hope's Peak? Wait a minute, you're all too young to be in Hope's Peak. They have like some sort of like... I don't know what age group these kids are. Uh... I don't know, elementary school? Hmm? Why should that surprise you? I... I I didn't know there was an elementary school affiliated with the academy. <laughs> Such an ignorant woman. Anyway, who's next? Perhaps Jotaro? Is he the creepy one? Uh, wait, before I go, can I practice introducing myself? Um, what was I gonna say? Uh, I'm the priest, Jotaro Komori. You know how when you stare into moving bicycle spokes, you get all scared? Oh my god, you're either gonna be the worst one or the best one. I don't know which. The only... Okay, so this is a strange thing to point out. In, in a lot of anime <laughs> and in games, there are like characters that I... Character archetypes and characters that I just... I do not like that type of character. But sometimes, occasionally, a character will push so far over into, like, in, into something I hate that it wraps around and becomes amazing because they become a parody of, of the thing that I hate. And I, I don't know how this character is gonna go, but he's already, he's already way weird. He is. He's already weird. He's the weirdest character I've seen in all of Danganronpa, and there have been weird characters. Like, for some reason, you imagine how painful <laughs> it would be to put your hand in. Why? 
Oh, um, my name is Jachiro Kamuri, and bird skin isn't yummy no matter how you cook it. What type of bird are you talking about? I was really good at arts and crafts, so they called me a little ultimate art. Of course the art one would be the craziest of them all. If it's arts and crafts, leave it to me. I can remove nails and varnish and things. I do the priest thing for the warriors of hope. Oh, and also, I wonder if aliens exist. And you specialize in arts and crafts, making you little ultimate art, correct? Moving on. Uh, you said what I was gonna say. The whole thing. Oh, my chest itches. I wish I could scratch it raw, reach inside and scrape my nails on it. Oh my god. Your speeches are always too long. It's like how an elephant's nose is so long. But then again, giraffe necks are long too. And you're kind of weird as well. And also waiting for a plane takes too long, and spring break is too long. I've never heard of anybody complaining that spring break is being too long. Uh, um... Well, anyway, don't worry about Jatero. He's a latchkey kid. It made him a bit mental. Whoa, 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 wait. Wait, I actually know what that is. I've heard of that. It, oh, what? Wait, 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 wait. I, I think I've heard of that. What is it? What was it? it? It was because... Wait, you know what? Technically, I think I was a latchkey kid as well. Because I would return home and my parents weren't weren't there either when I got home. Except, uh, it, instead of having, uh, I didn't have a, I didn't have a key to the house, but what I did have was a, a pin code to open up the garage door. And the, um, the bus driver would always wait for me to type in the pin code and go into the garage before she drove off. Um, <laughs> When I was in elementary school. And then she would drive off after she saw, like, the garage door go up and I slipped under. It's not that I dislike latchkey kids, though. Some kids say they have magical powers. Isn't that awesome? You might get caught inside a magical parallel universe! Oh, sorry for the late introduction. My name's Kotoko Utsugi, and I play the role of fighter. All right, you're the fighter. Ahoy, a girl! My <sighs> name is Kotoko Utsugi, and I play the fighter in the Warriors of Hope. You might think the fighter would be a boy, but nope, I'm totally a girl. I love girly things and peeled chestnuts. If it's totally adorbs, I love it! It's kind of weird that you are the... fighter. And I was pampered as the little ultimate drama in elementary school. But who cares about that old stuff? I'm so happy to meet you! So, <laughs> I gotta tell you, um, P.E., I guess I can understand that, being just, like, ultimate in all athleticism. I can understand ultimate, uh, drama, and I can totally get ultimate art. Ultimate social studies is still super weird. I was called Little Ultimate Drama, but that was a long time ago, so I'll leave that part out. My favorite food is peeled chestnuts. My least favorite food is unpeeled chestnuts. So basically, you like chestnuts. <laughs> Aren't you surprised? They're both chestnuts. Uh, um, <laughs> And hey, did you know kangaroos can jump backwards? I did not know that. And, and, and believe it or not, snakes have ears. Know why that's you. <laughs> yes, yes, that's all very nice. Our next introduction is Monica. Okies. Monica is a mage. Okay. Monica is called Monica. Monica's a mage in the Warriors of Hope. 
Monica likes to talk in the third person because that makes Monica sound ultra cute. Don't you love it? I love being... Oops. I mean, Monica likes being Monica because Monica is the best. I was known as Lil Ultimate Homeroom while I was in elementary school. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ultimate Social Studies is way less stupid than Ultimate Homeroom. What is Ultimate Homeroom? What sort of... What, what does that even do? You might think there are no ultimates in commons in a class like Homeroom, but there are. That makes no sense. For me, my skill isn't really about uniting people. It's about getting them all to help me. Because what? Because you're pitiful? I don't get it. Believe it or not, I bring together a lot of wonderful people. It would be nice if you could be a wonderful person for Monica too. Uh, nope. Because you're crazy. I can already tell. You're crazy. And you're probably the actual leader. And when I attended elementary school, I was called the Lil Ultimate Homeroom. I'm sure you're familiar with it, right? Homeroom? I don't know what homeroom is like for the rest of the world, but at least when I was growing up, homeroom was... wasn't really like a... a class per se. Homeroom was technically whatever classroom you started in, and mine was English, and... It, homeroom didn't really exist because it was basically just English class. You would just, if if something had to happen, they would say, "Oh, you need to report back to your homeroom," which was English. So you didn't do anything for homeroom outside of English class. In my case, like if if I had been in the homeroom of like a math teacher, it would have been homeroom is basically math. There's no, you don't do anything in homeroom. It's just a place. Monica just loves homeroom! The first hour of the day when we can share our thoughts! I guess in Japan, you get like a, a whole hour to do whatever homeroom is. And that is why, even in the Warriors of Hope, I'm the life of the party! Uh, but you are familiar with the Warriors of Hope. Uh, you guys. N no the Warriors of Hope are heroes who save the world from demons. Isn't that amazing? We're a party of heroes that hunt down demons. But nobody really wants me in the group. And I'm the party leader, which makes me the number one king of this town. Uh, um, you... You kids are just joking, right? With demons and kings? I probably wouldn't say that, being as... I think you're actually their hostage right now. Joking around? I mean, you guys are just kids, right? For a bunch of kids to be doing this kind of stuff. You've probably just helped tie the noose around your neck, Komaru. Just kids? Huh? Aw, that's the only thing I can say. Just aw. Since you're an about to be, we were thinking, well, doesn't matter. You're clearly a demon. Okay, so demons are, um, older people. Adults, children, the power structure remains the same. The subjects have merely been switched. With our Monokumas, you'll be nothing more than a squashed bug beneath our feet. Splattered like the sound of bloody chopped meat. <laughs> Intestines falling out of you like sausages. <laughs> oh, he's he's crazy. Oh, stop that, Jotaro. If you say it like that, she'll think we're joking. Huh? Our Monokumas? So the ones controlling those Monokumas out there are... That's right! Isn't it so cool? The Monokumas obey any order we give them. All thanks to Monica's magic. Yeah, that's our mage. She can use magic even without magic circles. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. You're so nice. So you are probably the actual leader. You're the one who somehow controls Monokumas. 
is so adorbs! Oh, I just want to smother you in syrup and eat you up! N no! Stop it! Stop! Stop? Which part? If what you're saying is true, please stop all of this! We will not. We will never stop until we've completed our paradise. Paradise? Oh, you didn't hear our address? A paradise made up children, by children, for children. We're gonna kill all the adults in this town and make a paradise just for kids! Isn't it awesome? No school or homework in paradise! Woohoo! Why must fireflies die so young? And since our paradise is for children only, there won't be any more pedophiles either! That's the second time you've made a remark. But can we keep the ice cream store? The ice cream didn't do anything wrong. What are you saying? What are you talking about? It doesn't make any sense! Kamara, we can just ignore... Uh, the, the little ultimate artist. We can just ignore him. Monica's mad! It's going to be alright, Monica. Please, don't get upset. It's all going according to plan. That's right. If Monica says it, then white is black, cats are dogs, and um... What else? Oh, please. Oh, please don't get mad. We'll kill a lot of adults, see? So just smile, okay? Hey! How dare you make Monica mad! That's the last straw! As the leader, I'm gonna hunt you down! Hunt? Let us play a game. You will be our demon prey. It's a really fun game. <laughs> a godly game. <laughs> it was Monica's idea, after all. Okay. And the name of the game is... Demon hunting. Ta-da! Demon hunting! Demon hunting is a game where you release demons into Toa City. They're the targets. It's a super fun game where the Warriors of Hope fight to see who takes down the demon first. Wow, that sounds super fun! And our very own Monica came up with it. See, Monica? We're going to play our special game. No need to be upset now, right? Hmm. Yes, yes, so exciting. Let's do it. Come on, hurry up and let's do it. Mm, no. By target, you mean? Probably you. You, hurry up and prepare the device. This wristband is a custom-made device given to the targets of the game. It would be best if you didn't try to remove it. Any tampering with it, and you'll go boom. Boom? Okay, then. Now we're ready. All right, let's go hunting. W wait, wait, hold on. This is a break, isn't it? You're just kidding around. You've seen what we've accomplished so far. This is no joke. For an adult, you sure are dense. No, no, you don't understand. I'd be no good at this game. If you throw me into that town, I, I just get killed immediately. I'm, that's no fun, right? Ooh, so modest. But we know you don't die easy. You passed that test earlier. Ha <laughs> ha That was only because I had this gun. Anyway. That test was splendid. It was amazing how you were able to evade those Monokumas and make it this far. I guess it's all thanks to my advice from earlier. Mm -hmm. Um, Komaru, he's strongly telling you, don't tell them about the stupid gun. Advice from earlier? Yes. However, even after you meet everyone, 
<laughs> Be sure to keep that gun of yours a secret. Literally told you that. How are if you, you don't forgetting? Want to die, that is. Uh. Hey, no talking without the leader's permission. You're just a servant. Next time you talk without getting the okay from me, I'm gluing your mouth shut. <laughs> that is quite a scary thought. Well, let's get on with it. Why? What? Why are you doing something so cruel? I didn't even do anything bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. You're too funny. <laughs> I'm laughing so hard my cheeks hurt. We play the games because they're fun. Duh. <laughs> That's the only reason. You're only surprised because you aren't used to this way of doing things. This is just what we like. We do it because it's fun. And that truly is the only reason. Searching for meaning in the meaningless is for adults. Children are untainted by such futility. But to tell you the truth, I would rather not play this game. There is still much work to be done to build our paradise, yet here we are playing games. Why? Why don't you stop? We cannot do that. This is Monica's game. She said she wants it done, so it will be done. Monica is the princess. Everyone on our team tries to grant the princess's wish. And I love what Monica loves. So that's basically the situation. Thank you, Nagisa. Even though you're so busy, you did all this work for the sake of my game. I'll have to bake you some delicious cookies later as thanks. Y yeah, thank you. Someone has a crush on Monica. Oh, that's so not fair. I want to eat Monica's cookies too. Hey, Monica. What about me, the leader? Why? How can you kids just keep smiling like that? You're... you're not normal! Hmm... Of course an adult sees this as abnormal. But who cares what adults say? There you go, you're getting her all worked up again. Also, Kamaru Naegi, in your current situation, you don't have the right to say a thing. You cannot choose your path, because this place you're in, it isn't a path at all. What? You are not on a path. You are falling into an abyss. The darkness gaping open beneath your feet. You are just going to fall and fall. Don't you feel the pull of gravity? What do you mean? She means this! Floor gonna fall out from below me. Kaboom. Yeah. <laughs>Tomorrow, your skirt has an amazing ability to just like not fly up. I appreciate it. Oh, good job holding it down there. <laughs> Are they in like an airship or something? A child's ears are... Wonderful, wonderful ears. ears! A child's eyes are... Adorable eyes. eyes! A child's mouth is... A, a great, great big, big mouth. mouth! Why is it so big? To, to gobble, gobble up the demons! The demons. <laughs> <laughs> Let's say this particular demon will be worth an extra high score because it upset us. <laughs> then it looks like I'll win when I catch it. A game is different than reality, so that means even I can actually win. My, my. It's rare to see Jotaro so pumped, but it also makes him extra gross. 
that don't matter. At the end of the day, the one who wins is gonna be me, the leader. Now, now, it doesn't matter who wins. Just make sure you don't fight while playing the game. Well, anyway, do you guys wanna get a cola or something? Ooh, a soda sounds great. Someone go buy some. Leader's orders. And just like that, the pieces are in place. All that's left now is to wait for the despair. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. All right. Do your best, Miss Protagonist. With your lack of distinct characteristics. So common, so dull, so boring. Prologue. The Warriors of Hope, end. <clears throat> to be continued. Am I ever gonna save? Oh, thank God, a save. Chapter one. Crying for love in hell. Yay, shadows. <laughs> ow, 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 ow! Uh, that was so scary! <laughs> you have your gun! Take it out! <laughs> Shoot him! <laughs> oh, it's it's Toko. <laughs> or rather genocide or show probably. <laughs> Her skirt. <laughs> no wonder it sucks more than the other one. Well, that's modern technology for you. <laughs> I mean, it's not like this is sci fi or something. It's borderline sci fi at most. There goes <laughs> the fourth wall. <laughs> uh, um. Yes, madame. What business do you have with me? Uh, are you. Here to rescue me? <laughs> Dekumaru, was it? It's Komaru. Komaru Naegi. And where's Master Biakia? You know where he is, right? Huh? huh? <laughs> that gun you're holding. Oh, it's dripping with the Master's scent. Of course. <laughs> you can. 
smell it? I I hadn't really forgotten that she was way into Byakia, but it, 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 it is one of the things that has somewhat slipped my mind upon seeing her again. You got a death wish or something? Hiding Master from me will cut your life expectancy! <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm not hiding it! Ten, nine, eight, seven... <laughs> what are you doing? She's wanting you to tell her where he is. If you don't give me my Master by the time I get to zero, I'm gonna cut you like wet mochi! Four, three, two... Oh, hold on! I really don't know... What? Is she about to go back? Tell me, you're Kamaru Nagi, aren't you? I got it, right? Uh, I just told you that. Oh, did you? I, I, I can't help it, you know? I don't share memories with her. Her? Uh, memories? G Jeez, stop saying stuff that makes no sense. Everything is confusing enough as it is. Tell her that you have a split personality. Well, you can call me your ally. Then come on! If we don't hurry, we're gonna get attacked! It, it's alright. Huh? No, it's... it's alright. I can do it, because I made a promise with him. <laughs> That ability is not a curse, it's a talent. Huh. An um, amazing talent that holds huh. incredible possibilities. Oh my gosh. Ah, master, <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. Master that talent. Do it for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes. Oh, gross. I would just stay out of her fantasies. Like I said, it will be all right. I can make good use of her now. I've learned a lot since then. We're gonna take them all down right here, right now. I'll, I'll smash them to pieces. Let's go, um, oh, Omaru Naegi. Omaru? Time for a tutorial. If you press the triangle button, you'll switch with Genocide Genocide Jack. Not only does she not take damage, but she uses a super strong attacks as well. If I accidentally call her Genocide or Show, just roll with me on it and, and let me let me just say that. I'll I'll try to call her Genocide Jack though. Press the square button to attack and circle button to evade. Hold the square button for a special skill. Also, you can focus on enemies with the L2 button, and if you press either the X or triangle button, you can unleash the super powerful Slash Lust. Feel free to try it out. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Say 
lend me your energy? I'm sure you do. That that uh that whole roar thing that was going off, they remind me of something from JoJo. So how did you like using Genocide ja Jack? Oops, I forgot to mention, there's a time limit for using Genocide Jack. Of course there is. Use up the batteries in the top left of the screen and you'll automatically revert to Toko. Also, you can't just use Slash Less limitlessly. Yeah, I didn't think so. Charge the less gauge on the bottom right, and when it's full, you can use Slash Lust. The Lust Gauge fills up when Genocide Jack defeats enemies. Do a single 1 gauge attack with L2 Triangle, and a 3 gauge combo move with L2 plus X. You go back to Kamaru with the Triangle button at any time, so be smart during battle. Oh, did I miss out on those coins? <sighs> The, that was all of them, right? Amazing! That was amazing! W what was that just now? It's like you were a totally different person. Too casual. Huh? D -d Don't speak to me so casually, like I'm one of your friends or something. I'm your senior. But, but you still haven't told me your name. I'm sure you're just going to forget it right away. But it's Toko Fukawa. Toko Fukawa? Oh, sorry for having such a boring name. I bet you think it's perfect for a hag like me, right? I, I don't think that at all. And anyway, what was that all about earlier? You were a completely different person. Just explain to her that you have two personalities. I couldn't tell you. What? I d don't remember. Didn't I already tell you? We don't share memories. Um, I don't really get it. Ugh, it's like I said, I have a split personality. That girl was Genocide Jack. Okay? Y you don't believe me, right? You think I'm just some filthy woman who's sick in the head. You're probably wondering how a stupid pig managed to learn how to talk, aren't you? I don't think that's... Well, maybe the first bit? <laughs> I mean, it's true that it's a little hard to believe, and I was pretty surprised. But if that's what you say, I believe you. You believe me just like that? What are you, stupid or something? Well, what was I supposed to say? Well, if you really are this stupid, that just makes this easier. It's just... I feel like I've heard the name Genocide Jack somewhere before. I... I see. So, you still remember. Well, no point in hiding it now. It was all over the talk shows back in the day, after all. Talk shows? Wait. Could it be... No. Never mind. Couldn't be. <laughs> yeah, just deny it. <laughs> what? It's just... Uh, I feel like I've heard a similar name on the news about some serial killer. Yeah, that's the one. What? B but that was just in the old days. I, I've completely tamed her since then. Mm. Master commanded me to discover the secret. And I learned the stun gun does the trick. Oh, that's what it, that's why there's batteries. And depending on how much shock I give myself, after a while I go back to my normal self. <laughs> Isn't it great? It's all thanks to Master Byakuya. Uh, anyway, it seems like a good skill to have. With that power, we can get through them easy. Don't be dense. Huh? Didn't I just say I need the stun gun to change? <laughs> My brain would fry if I just did it over and over. I can't just use it at will like that. Really? Anyway, what is your relationship with Master Byakuya, hmm? Why do you have that hacking gun? I, I was saved by him earlier. He, he gave this gun to me. S saved? 
Master Byakuya saved you? I will. I will protect Komaru Naegi. I swear it on my life. No. I swear in the name of the Togami family! <laughs> Not get ahead of yourself just because you're ugly in a in a cute way why are you angry remember this i won't let anyone interfere in my romance with master i'm going to rescue master and then in the heat of the moment we'll oh. <laughs> huh rescue Toko, you are crazy enough. I think I might like you a lot at the end of this. Oh, wait, hold on. Byakuya was captured? What, you just figured that out? Why would I even be here if it weren't for Master? He was probably ambushed by cowards. There's no way he'd just allow himself to be captured. I... I see. So he was caught after all. You better not feel responsible for this. You're you're right. My worrying won't change anything. <sighs> What's with this chick? I can't believe I gotta take this into to sex in the world. What was that? <laughs> Nothing. And watch your mouth! I'm so terribly sorry? It's fine. You're a lost cause anyway. <laughs> But more importantly, I want to hurry up and find Master. Now is not the time to relax. You're right. We've got to get out of this building. Well then, after you. Huh? Why do I have to go first? You have Master's gun, don't you? But don't worry. When you're really in trouble, I'll save you. I can't have you dying on me. Now come on! Stop staring off into space and get moving already! You're not dead yet. <sighs> Fine. <gasps> the coins! They're still here! Oh, that's so good. It's also a heart, but I don't really need that. So... Nope. What is this thing? What is this? Training potty? Well, <laughs> if it isn't your little buddy, maybe you should try riding on it. Hey, who are you calling a baby? You're offended, but you're still gonna ride it? Huh. This is surprisingly relaxing. S seriously What the? Are these the save points? It is! <laughs> oh, I wonder if they're all gonna be training potties or if it's just this one. That's funny. Alright. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Danganronpa Ultra Despair Girls. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!